Kama mtutu zeri lungi le khatu. It's very particular, yabot. Yabot. Tende je, yabot. Guti yonki tibi rai pepo, yabot. Very hard, but a couple of drinks in, it tends to be a sweetheart, it tends to be a softie. One of the sexiest men in Zansi? Really? Man, that says a lot about the options out there, huh? Siabonga Ngwegaza, that's my name. Scoop is on a level of his own. I thought I was crazy. I know, but Scoop, I know, I he overwhelmed us all. And cut! Ouch! All right, Kamala Mukabili said Thomas Kumete. When I look at Thomas, uh, I see a lot of myself, energy wise. Oh, Mr. Kumete. Oh, should I call you Napoleon? Ah, no, Kumete. Funniest homes I know. The first time I started acting was 2004. I knew I had it in me. After I watched Bad Boys 1, I was like, man. That's what I want to do. I don't know how they got into that little TV. I don't know how come they don't die, but that's what I want to do for the rest of my life. Smiley City, ah, Bayabo. We started the show over there in 2010, although we are airing it now in 2012. And this is the reason why. Well, the original idea came from us all working at the 2010 Channel O Music Video Awards. My man, Steezy Ulungile Khatu, and myself were co hosting. And that's when he decided, Buffet, oh, boy. Let's just document our lives. And that's when we all started coming together to make sure you get a piece of our lives. Three, two, one. Next. After the show, it's the after party, yeah. After that, it... well. I get in there, and Samuel and Thomas are alone in the bedroom. I just think fellas were jealous that, you know what I'm saying? I got the hardest chick in the game rocking my chain. So they came to this day. Get out of the pan, champagne popping, spit too much out. The funk. Hey, kiss your mom. Your mom's always got his swag. Well, he always has his girlfriend too. Oh, Luigi. Oh, baby girl, you need to relax. Let a brother breathe a little bit, you know? My girl's gonna see how we get down. And I didn't really want her to see that, because then she'd be worried how wild we get when she's not around. But it is what it is. Things went a little bit overboard. Hi, Dima. Peer pressure. I've got voiceovers for gold diggers, but they're in Cape Town. And actually, this is a very good time to negotiate what I've always wanted. You will miss the director for once. Cold cut. Cut! I pick my steezy up to make Cape Town manager for us. We are tanda in Parkhurst with steezy. And I've got my boy there, Wakir comes up with this brilliant idea of going to Brazil. The carnival. Come on. I'm not sure if my relationship can handle another speed bump at the moment. Let's go, fellas. Let's go to Rio de Janeiro. Yeah, I'm speaking to the fellas only. What's wrong with that? A boy's trip to Rio de Janeiro. She probably thinks, gee whiz, if I'm not there, how wild can things get? Yes, there are going to be women there. Because it's a country with male and females. As soon as she goes, but why aren't the girls don't invite? I'm like, cheers! Ah! <laughs> what, you don't trust your man? What are you trying to say? What's going to happen? <laughs> Is he ever going to come back to me? And I can understand her worry. He might not, Sam. <laughs> As we hit the airport, the energies are running here. Well, at least for myself at school. Thomas is a bit conflicted, because when in a situation here with his girlfriend. Until I'm totally phone call in. I am looking at him take this call, and I can tell there's problems. We need to get a player whose schedule just opened up. shooter, no. If he can't go, that's his bad. He better sort it out. This is where friendship ends, and the vacation starts. <laughs>